Hello everyone, Phoenix Knight here. Welcome to the channel, and welcome to the greatest boxer tournament in Title Bout 2. With some extra time today, we're finally going to jump into the tournament with at least one bout in the tournament. I'm thinking we'll go through three, but each bout will be a separate video. This bout will feature one of the picked winners, so we'll bring the bracket in shot for a second so I can point out which fight, which bout we're actually starting with. Let me zoom this in. So we're actually going to start with this bout right here. Rocky Balboa versus Vladimir Klitschko, which will feature one of our picked winners. So Matthew's winner is actually going to be taking center stage first in the tournament. So with that, let's go meet the fighters. First up being represented by John Cena, we've got Rocky Balboa. Heavyweight, he's an overall rating of an 11. He's a slugger and a lefty, which I don't think does anything special. We won't need to worry about his special abilities either. He takes control on a 10 or a 12. Aggressiveness and killer instinct of 10. Endurance of 90. Foul rating of B. Defense is a 4, so we'll add 4 to the, pun to the punches landed range. KD 1 and 2 of 4 and 0. Knockout of 0. Cut 5 and counter punch range 4. So we can see the punches landed there. So we'll bring him over to the ring and we'll go through Klitschko. Roman Reigns will be handling representation detail for Vladimir Klitschko today, Dr. Steelhammer. Balboa's nickname was the Italian Stallion, by the way. I've been kind of gloss over that. No specials here. Takes control on a 10 on either one. Aggressiveness, aggression killer instinct at 8. 90 endurance, foul rating of an A. No defense, Knockdown 1 and 2 of 4 and 3. Knockout rating of 2. Cut 5. Counterpunch 4. And once again, there you see his actions. So we can move him over to the ring, and then we'll take a, our first look at the ring. As you can see, in the, as you might be able to see in the toy ring, it might be a little bit hard to read, but I did put together a, a reminder for myself on where each spot in the ring is. So we've got near corner, near ropes, right neutral so on and so forth. That's mostly to help me keep the ring position straight whenever we have ring movement. So I just wanted to take a quick look at that. Everything looks good there. The crowd in the International Space Station is buzzing, so let's sound the bell and start round one. There's the bell, and here we go. Rocky Balboa will be our first, our aggressor. Both of them will take control on a 10 on a control check, which Balboa will not start with control. Klitschko will not get control either. Balboa does get control. Let's see what he's doing. 35 is a missed punch, no counter punch. Balboa stays in control. 34, still another missed punch, no counter punch. Balboa stays in control. 80 is ring movement. We are moving. Staying in ring center. Balboa stays in control. 42, Misses a punch, no counter punch for Klitschko. Balboa stays in control. 24 finally lands a punch. He will land. 30 cut. So 30 is good for a two point hook, which will bring him on the board. I've got these dials from Marvel Champions. Then for a cut check, is that the Second deck or the unused of the first? I always forget how this works. I believe it's the... I usually go to the second deck, but I think it's the... Uh, here we go. Using the... Determining the outcome. So 24... Sorry, I'm having to stop and check this. All you need to do is make a single check, yada, yada, yada. Okay, so... Okay, so flip the next card in the boxing action deck and check the random number. Then add the opponent's... Okay, so we flip another card, get a random number, and add the boxer's cut rating. So we're adding 5 to this. 
5 and 45 is 50, which will bring us over to the cut table. So at 50, we see a minor cut under the left eye, which means we're a plus one cut to Klitschko's cut rating. Let me make a note of that. Uh, minor cut under left eye. That'll be a one and plus one cut. Just trying to make some notes here. Okay, so three, so two points to Balboa, who gets the next control check. Stays in control. 55 is a clinch. Back to Balboa again. 15, no control. Klitschko takes control. Let's see what Klitschko is doing for his first control. 11, lands a punch. So Klitschko will get on the board with a four for a three-point jab. Pardon the muffled car alarm I'm hearing in the background. Other way. I'm just going to make sure real quick that that car alarm isn't mine, but I don't think it is. No, it's not. And it just shut off. Okay, good. Klitschko is still... Klitschko gets the next control check, which he loses control. Balboa... No control, Klitschko. No, Balboa. Takes control back, Balboa. 73 is ring movement, so where are we headed? Staying in ring center. Balboa. No control, Klitschko. Takes control. He. 53 will clinch. Klitschko. No control. Balboa. No control. Klitschko. Takes control. I probably should have mentioned as well that we are using just a normal referee today. He'll check on the... I believe he checks on the... Fourth point deduction, so. All right, so coming back, Klitschko had just taken control. 66 is ring movement, so where's Klitschko leading us? Klitschko is staying in ring center. Next control check for Klitschko. No control, Balboa. No control, Klitschko. No control, Balboa. No control, Klitschko. No control, Balboa. Takes control. 43 misses a punch just out of Klitschko's, or just out of, um, yeah, just out of Klitschko's uh, range to counter punch. So Balboa stays in control. 48, misses a punch. Klitschko can try to counter punch. Foul, uh-oh. That brings us to the special, to the other deck. Foul is a 74 against a rating of an A. I think even at a 74 with an A rating, he's going to get a point taken away. Yep, Klitschko takes the point away for a low blow. So... Minus one, low blow. All right, so Klitschko did get a counter punch there, which means he gets the next control check. He stays in control. 67 is ring movement. We are headed. Staying in ring center. Klitschko keeps control. 10 is actually a power, uh, 10? No, it's just outside of power shot range. So we do resolve the punch. So he will find. 61 is good for a three point combination, which I'm only going to give him two because he was losing a point anyway. But more importantly, that's the end of round one. So Klitschko picked up five points on that round.
Balboa picked up two, I think. Which means we need to see how the judges score the round. So that'll bring us over to the second deck. Section on the judges. They're going even high, high. So Klitschko will pick up the win in... We'll pick up the win for round one after I finish adding these up. So even is 10-10. 10 10 10-10-10 for Klitschko. All right, so I will go ahead and reset the decks, and then we'll st and then Klitschko will be our aggressor, so he'll start round two. There's the bell, so let's start round two. Klitschko gets our first control check. Hang on. One thing I almost forgot to do, I almost forgot to reset the dials for the points. Almost makes me glad I ended up with two Marvel Champions core sets because those dials are really handy. Anywho, we'll move that up a bit as well. Klitschko will start off without control. Balboa, no control either. Klitschko takes control. 74 is ring movement, so where are we moving to? Moving to the far ropes. So now Klitschko has a plus one on his control checks while he's got Balboa up against the far ropes. Which an 18 will not do. Balboa takes control. 27 lands a punch. Uh, yeah, lands a punch. So Balboa will land. 38 is good for a three-point cross. So that'll bring Balboa... Onto the board first in round two with three points. So Balboa will not take control. Klitschko, no control either. Balboa, yes, will take control. 17 will land another punch. And he will land. 35 is good for a two-point hook. So that'll bring Balboa up. to five points on the round. Balboa keeps control. 13 is just out of power, is just out of power shot range, but that's good, good enough to land a punch, which will be a 15, and that'll be good for another three-point hook. So Balboa is getting a good start on this round, so he's up to eight points already. Klitschko is yet to score. Balboa no control. An 11 would work for Klitschko here, though. A 9 is plenty good enough for that, though. 72 is ring movement, so where are we moving to? Moving to the near ropes now. So Klitschko will still have a plus 1 on his control check. So once again, an 11 will still work for him. Or a 2. That'll work, too. Foul. Uh-oh. So he's an A. 53, I think, is just going to be a warning. Yeah. Scold the fighters. No hitting behind the head. Oops. So that should be there. Klitschko. Actually, no. Yeah. Okay. No. Should be this way. Okay, now that I got that straight, Klitschko keeps control. Another foul. Good lord. Klitschko is turning into a dirty, rotten cheater here. 57. Getting yelled at again for hitting behind the head. Uh, Klitschko stays in control. One is a, definitely a power shot, so Balboa is a is a KD1 rating of 4 against... We need a KD number here. So a 3 on the... So the KD number of 3 against the KD1 of 4. 
who's going to be good for four points to Klitschko. So Klitschko gets on the board in somewhat of a big way with a power shot. So four points to Klitschko. And Klitschko gets the next control check, so he will not keep control. Balboa will take it. 36, misses a punch, no counter punch. Balboa stay, stays in control. Lands a power shot of his own. Two is definitely good for a power shot. Klitschko is a four as well against a 17. Uh-oh. So 17 against a KD one of four. Brings us to a K1 to 10. So on a 1 to 10, score 6 points. And full killer instinct. So that brings us to... I believe that's a... I believe that's another... I believe that's another KD rating. So that'll come from here, we will find. Is a 2. So Balboa will score 6 points. Which will bring him up to 14. We'll bring the fighters back to ring center because Balboa is about to have full killer instinct and he's got a KI rating of 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we're assuming Balboa is in control for all of these. So Balboa starts off with another power shot. Good grief. Okay. So that's a 4 against a 13, which... 13. There's another 5 points to Balboa, so he's up to 19 now. Alright, so coming back here. 31. Missed punch, no counter punch. 10 is yet another power shot. Uh, a so against a KD rating of so ten against so ten against another four is another five points to Balboa. This might be look. This is looking like it, folks, because Balboa is up to twenty four points on the round. Next up, sixty is a clinch. 75 is ring movement, so we are headed headed to the near ropes as Balboa is taking control on Klitschko. 52 is a clinch as well, and 64 is another clinch. So Klitschko is in a very bad way in this coming out of this killer instinct. Balboa gets our next control check. He keeps control. 39. Misses a punch, no counter punch. Balboa loses control. Klitschko can't take it. Balboa no control. Klitschko takes control. Injury, uh-oh. Something probably happened during that Killer Instinct run. No injury treated, it's just a break in the action. Klitschko for the last card of the round. Would take control, but... That is the end of round two, and not a moment too soon for Klitschko, because Balboa just... Balboa just absolutely went to town in that round. 24-4. to four. Six, five, nine, and I'm pretty sure on a margin like that, yep, Balboa will win. Balboa will definitely win the round 10 to 8. So 10, 10, 10, 8, 8, 8. Which means Balboa, let me just, I'm just doing a little bit of bookkeeping off of, off shot. So 81, 24 is 64. 
So Balboa will end up being our aggressor for round three. I'm going to do a little bit of maintenance to reset the decks, and then when we come back, we'll be ready for round three. There's the bell, so let's start round three. Balboa's our aggressor this time because he won the round pretty handily. And he starts off with no control. Klitschko will take control. Come on. Going for a foul right away. 32 on an A is probably going to get waved off. Uh, no, actually, not for an A. He's going to caution both fighters to keep it above the keep the punches above the waist. Klitschko, no control. Balboa takes control. Picks up right where he left off in round one with a power shot. So Klitschko is a KD one rating of four against a seventeen, which I think we know how this goes. So we get another KD. So we need to get another KD rating on a 1 to 10, score 6 points and a full killer instinct. On 11 to 20, 6 points and remainder of the, and add KD 2 for the rest of the round. So our KD rating here is a 1. So Balboa is going to score 6 points and get his full killer instinct. We need to be careful here as well. Because if Balboa picks up at least 26 points in this round, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. If Balboa picks up at least 26 points in this round, fight will be over on a two-round TKO for scoring 50 points over two rounds. So let's see where Balboa starts. He'll start 25 by landing a punch. For a 70 cut. So 70 is good for a three-point uppercut which will bring him to nine points. And then this one, next number, this next one is going to be a five plus 22 is a 27, which I believe at best is no cut or swelling. Okay. So Balboa, 26 lands another punch. 28 is a two point hook. So that'll bring Balboa up to 11 points. Next up. Oh, come on. Foul, but those don't get checked during Killer Instinct. 46. Misses a punch. Klitschko can try to counter punch. 79. Won't get it done. Bow back to Balboa. 10 is another power shot, which will bring us into... I believe we check from here, I think, during Killer Instinct. Uh, no. We do go, go to here, so... Uh, yeah. Which is going to be a KD rating of an 18. Which is actually a, knock, a potential knockout. So, scores 6 points, which will bring Balboa up to 17. Then we need a check for a knockout. So we're going to use this card. Klitschko right now is a knockout of two. So we need a knockout rating on this card. Knockout rating is a 14, which I don't think will end the fight. Two against a 14. No, won't end the point. But he will get his full killer instinct again. No, he won't actually. Not during... Not, he won't. He can't chain Killer Instinct into Killer Instinct, so never mind that. But Balboa is dominating this round. He's up 17 zip, and he's got the next control check. Which he keeps control. Wow, he'll land another power shot. So a 4 against a 10... Four against the 10 is just another five point shot for Balboa. So Balboa is up to 22 points. Which means now we're definitely getting into, we're definitely getting into TKO territory. So Balboa, 
no control. Klitschko needs to stop the carnage. A 10 will give him control at least to help with that. A 60 is a clinch. Clinch he needs desperately. Klitschko. No control. Balboa. Takes control back. Lands another power shot. This could be it. Let's see what we get here. KD rating of a, thir a 4 against a 13. So 13 against a 4 is a 5H. So he goes straight to the control punch, but... So he goes straight to the control check, but we have a small problem because that brings Balboa up to 27 points and... Referee's waving it off on a TKO for 27 points to Balboa in the round, which will bring Balboa up to a total of 51 points over two rounds. So Rocky Balboa has defeated Vladimir Klitschko in... So that was at... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 25 cards left is... One, four, one minute, 40 seconds left in the third round. So, Balboa over Klitschko, 140 of the third round. So, that'll bring me over to the bracket. Come on. Oh, I've got the file locked. Hang on. i got to go close the brackets in Excel. I forgot I had the brackets open on my com on my computer, so should be able to discard the changes. I will reopen it in here. We go, greatest boxer tournament. So Rocky Balboa has advanced, which means my brackets busted because I had Klitschko advancing out of this bout. So Matthew's winner is still in it. So he's picked up one point, but neither of us are going to score any points for the round predictions because he had. He had Balboa winning in seven rounds. I had Klitschko winning in five rounds. So Matthew picks up a point. I pick up Bubkiss out of this first bout. And his winner's still in it. So that is our first bout in this greatest boxer tournament for title bout two. I'm expecting to have at least one more bout later today. We'll see about maybe getting another one in after that. As for what's scheduled on the channel, Wednesday we'll be playing Twilight Inscription. And Sunday, we're playing Star Wars Outer Rim. Thank you for watching the video. Please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to turn on notifications so you get my content. Be well, stay safe, take care of yourselves and your loved ones, and I'll be back with more videos in the future. Until then, take care, everyone.